Hello. Okay, I'm pretty sure we can go outside now. Because there's nobody. Because there's nobody. Yay. What's happening? Are you? Have you been under a rock? Am I okay? I've never been more okay. I just. <laughs> I've not been living next to a dead person. This mystery has been solved. There's no dead body. The, my still my question and I wonder if they would let me ask it and if they would answer me of why would the dogs mark if there's no nothing there I don't know I have no idea I am not an expert on cadaver dogs do we unfollow now if you must if you feel the need to delude if you have to I would prefer if you stay preferably Nothing was in the rug. We don't know. I don't know why it was there. This, don't know. I don't know, but it's not a dead person. That's what we do know. <coughs> um, we know it's not a body. I have not been in any comments, although people have been sending me videos that have crazy comments. Um, I'm glad now you all know that I'm not the murderer because apparently that was a theory that I did it and I, there's nothing did, so I did not. I don't know. They took parts of it, but like, so who knows? I don't know why the dogs hit on it. That's still a question in my brain. Like how did both dogs do that? I don't know. I have no way of knowing. There is no body. Now it's okay. So there's no body. And I feel like every time I say that, I just keep taking another deep breath. This has been an experience. They found a rug. That's what they found. They found a rug. And we don't know why. And I don't know why the dogs sniffed on it and sat on it that will forever like that moment will forever be ingrained in my brain like someone someone give me a high a high noon <laughs> when I tell you my thoughts this morning <laughs> I was like well the value of my home just went down everyone knows where I live and the value of my home went down so not only do I want to move but I won't be able to sell it that was my that was my thought process this morning after my nap, because I didn't go to bed until four in the morning. So <clears throat> they took the rug. Um, they did take, it didn't come out as, as in one full piece. It kind of came out in like itty bitty pieces. Um, I'm assuming the excavator kind of F that up. Not itty bitty pieces, but like chunks. It came out in chunks. <sighs> I have a headache. I don't. Um, so yeah, they took the rug. There's no body. There's no bones. There was no bones. Yeah. Party it up with me. We're all celebrating. We are all celebrating. There's no body. I still want to know why my computer broke. Because if uh, the 162,000 of you, you may or may not know this. This all started because, yes, we saw the rug. This is spooky season. This was perfect, right? We saw the rug when we dug the post hole. And truly I was like, hmm, this is weird. And I was gonna let it lie. I was like, I don't know, nothing's like, it piqued my curiosity, of course, but like not to the extent where I was going to destroy my yard. Not enough to destroy my yard. And then my computer got shattered. In this room, so this is my sunroom. And I, I, I worked one night and then I came downstairs Someone's ringing the doorbell. It's probably the police. They're gonna want me. Um, I assume we can stay on live. Let's see. I'm not sure. Un momento. Hello. Hello. 
So we're finishing up. Okay. Uh, just to let you know, we found nothing to indicate any kind of body, human remains, anything. That is the best news I could have Absol ever heard. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. So we got the rug out there. It's gone. Okay. Um, we tried to put everything back the best way we could for you. Mm -hmm. um, you might want to check on the fence. I don't want you to let your bugs out. Yeah. Just make sure all that is how you guys want it. Uh -huh. I'm assuming it went in there the way, <laughs> the way you wanted it. So um, do you have any questions for us? He's going to have, have finish up with you here on the search warrant part. Okay. Do you have any questions for us before we leave? I guess my main question is why did both dogs sit in that spot? So we, we're not, we don't do the dogs. So okay. It's not the Columbus Police Department. So okay. That's something expertise wise. They have, um, you know, training and skills, whatever their certificates, they would be able to best explain that. Mm -hmm. From what I understand, it, like I, I think I told you this earlier, if somebody years ago had a nosebleed that went on that carpet. That's so crazy. They get sent to that. So it, it's just hard to tell. That so, could have been it. Who knows? Did the carpet go with you? Yeah, I the, assume? Car the carpet is going with us. Okay. So, but there's nothing to indicate any foul play or anything. Okay. Like that, so. Yep. Oh, okay. And, um, I know everybody else has got your information except me. Can you give me your first name? Um, Katie. And I, and I just want to make legal, sure legal first name. Catherine. Just, okay. Um, can I just write it? So I don't say it? Yeah. Okay. You don't want to put it out all over the region. I do not. Okay. And if you would, just follow that up with an email address that I can send you a yeah. document. Nice adventure. And a uh, phone number. And I'll have everything else. Okay. We tried to... Um, we tried to put it back as No, you really did. I truly, like... <laughs> as we, we didn't could. want to tear your stuff. I appreciate um, the effort, yeah, that's too. That's why we asked you about the, the adventure. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. Yeah. And uh, this is your copy of the search warrant. Okay. Um, I will send you a document detailing that we took carpet from the hole. Okay. That's all it is. Was it a lot of carpet? No, no really. No. It looked a lot, you know, like it just seemed like every yeah, time. Yeah, I feel like they were digging forever. So, I get it. Like I, yeah, yeah. yeah, I totally understand why all this had to happen. Yeah. Yep. <sighs> okay. Well, hopefully, just double check that snow fence back there so yeah. that your dogs don't get out. I don't okay. Be, but everything else we tried to put back is perfect. As yeah. As when we start. I can breathe now. Okay. <laughs> Thank you yep. so much. Have a good day. You too. I got an award. It's not, for all, it's not an award. I don't know what it is. A crime scene search unit. Varium. Varum? I don't know. I'm not. I'm here for TikTok, not for spelling. Verum? Quant? Quarter? Oh, do I keep trying? I might embarrass myself. Quarite? Verum? What the fuck? What does that say? I don't know. Look at this. <laughs> I mean, I get what he's saying. I, I don't. I assume you guys could heard, could could heard, could hear. He said that if the dog hits, they have to search because usually they're right. And thank God, today they weren't, or yesterday they weren't. Did these two dogs? These two dogs send us all on a wild goose chase? <sighs> yes, but they were cute and they were they were trying, and it was the end of a long day. And. I don't know why they sniffed. I think that is a question I will like be on my own deathbed someday and be like, why did those dogs do that? I don't know. The dogs do have some explaining to do. Can we interview the dogs? Can we interview the dogs? Can I pet the dogs now? Can I pet that dog? Do we think I can pet them now? Um, <clears throat> so, so yeah. So yes, there's no but the question again remains, is it possible it's below the carpet? No, ma'am. When I tell you, the is it possible it's below the carpet? No, ma'am. When I tell you these men were like, please don't call me. If you got my phone number, that's weird. I'm not gonna answer and just chit chat with you. I'm chit chatting with the world. You're all gonna get the same update. I literally feel like I can breathe now. So now, yeah, now I do think, 
I need to get a medium of some sort in here to to just double check on the on the neighbor. Dude, this thing keeps calling me. Um, we do need to see why my why my laptop broke. So I don't know if you heard why my laptop broke. So I don't know if you heard, they, they took the rug, um, they took the rug parts, and um, I assume we'll do some diddly-daddling test work on them just to triple check that all is well and all is good. It's lagging because someone, it's lagging because someone keeps work on them just to triple check that all is well and all is good. It's lagging because someone keeps calling me. So if, oh, can I turn my calls off? I don't know how that works. Explain the broken laptop. Sure, I would love to. Can I set you down? I'm tired of showing you my double chin. Look at this, my address somewhere on here, but this was a, an actual search warrant. <sighs> Let's all, this is what I do with my son. When my son's having a tantrum, we take deep breaths. That's what we do. Let's do that together. Um, okay. Um, are we still like, wow, I thought your plane mode was going to turn all this off. They're calling from no caller ID, so I can't even block them. So big middle finger to anyone who's calling me. Um, no middle fingers to the cute little kids who are outside. Honestly, may question the parents' decision-making skills to bring them to a potential um, on a opening of a what we thought we potentially were gonna find. Um, mm, but you do you. I do things that people will question too. <laughs> I was shocked to see so many small children outside my house though. Um, explain the broken laptop. So. answered all of your questions are we it's still not over I mean it's not over because I still want to know why my computer shattered so I think the next step is finding a psychic a I think psychics are I've seen one psychic that actually made me cry because it was the most um like amazing I should rest I promise you that is what's going to happen I have gotten essentially no sleep um for days um so rest i will do that <sighs> i'm still just like taking deep breaths what happened i hope that you have no idea and you're just popping in here and you've seen none of this because that would just be so funny where did the rug come from we don't know we do have cameras in our house so in and out they were already there but there's not any in this room so i think i need to get one for this room because this is where the shattering of the computer happened. Um, Cause this is actually one of the only rooms that doesn't have a, a camera. <sighs> Did he planted it? That motherfucker. He was trying to get the attention off of him. He was like, what can I do? Let me have this random girl in Columbus, Ohio that goes on a TikTok talking about mom life and random stories from her past. And let me just put it all on her. I bet it was Diddy. I, can we all collectively blame Diddy? I think that that's fun. I think that we blame him. What if they had found baby oil under the rug? Would that have not been? We really could have blamed him then. <sighs> okay. Have I checked the cameras? I need to get a camera um, for this room. What about the dogs that sat? I know, I told the detective, I'm going to live with that question till the day that I die. Both dogs. I asked them, it was all on live, I, some of you may have seen it. I asked them, is this normal for dogs to sit? And they said that their odds are usually more correct than incorrect, hence the entire fiasco based on a dog's opinion. Is this insane? All of this happened. Think of the trust that is put into these dogs. All of this happened. The resources that were put in resources that were put into this. There were f minimum 15 police officers. There were police officers 
resources that were put into this are based on a dog's nose. Is that not the most incredible thing? Like the thing, they told me that they have found bodies in water, like on a boat, from a boat. They have, they have sat when the boat gets there and then they stick their thing down. He said that this, the one detective in the suit, Miss Dr. Corn Nuts, told me yesterday that he was there on the boat and the dog sat on the boat and they put a little pokey stick in and they found a body. How does that happen? How does a dog get that right? And they got this wrong. I don't know. I don't know. There could still be something on the rug. There could still be something on the rug. There could still be something on the rug. What the? Brandon's outside trying to rebuild our makeshift fence because now we have to start over and build a new post hole. And that's what he's most upset about. Bring the dogs back. Yeah, I wonder what they would do without the, I don't know. I am not able to bring the dogs back. I can tell you that. Um, the police have to do that because prior to the homicide detectives finally coming and reaching out to me, I tried to bring the dogs in, but I need to eat. I, like I said, have not eaten in 24 hours. This has been a wild ride. For me, it is not over at all. Um, I am here to figure out the original mystery of who or what shattered my laptop in the middle of the night. That is the, the original mystery here. That is where we, this all began. And that mystery is still not solved. The rug, that mystery, we can check that one off the list. But my shattered computer and my desk that was just tousled around with these doors closed and no one in here in the middle of the night, that is a mystery that still remains. And I will forever till the day I die think about these dogs. And that's all she wrote for today. I'm gonna eat and possibly take a nap. My kids couldn't have done it, they weren't home. I have one kid, couldn't have done it, couldn't have done it. So he was in Kansas. So unless he can teleport, wasn't a kid. I'm, I'm gonna take this big bite, but I'm gonna turn off the camera first. Love you all. To the nice ones, thank you. To the mean ones, get out of here. Scram! Isn't that what she says? We don't want you here. That's how I feel to the mean people. Nice ones, please stay. This has been, now that there's no body, this has actually been something I'm gonna look back at as like one of the craziest, coolest things that have ever happened to me versus like craziest and most traumatic. Yesterday was traumatic. Yesterday was traumatic. Today, cool, calm and collected. I'm feeling good. But again, to the mean ones, scram. Get out of here. I don't want you here. To the nice ones, we just became lifelong friends, I hope because when I tell you there's so much happening, we're gonna figure out who broke this computer. That's my goal. It's been fun, 100K of you. Please hang up first. I don't like hanging up on you. It gives me anxiety. Hang up, all of you. Hang up on me first. Bye, please say, please say bye. I don't wanna, okay? I love you, I love you, goodbye. Please, I'm gonna hang up now. Um, don't make me feel bad. Okay. The Observer, providing you with the latest TikTok drama from across the UK.